Hello everybody, it's Loomer. Uh, just thought I'd give you guys a quick video update on what's been going on with uh, future videos, podcasts, etc. for my channel. And I also wanted to show you some of the new equipment I bought recently, which I think you guys will find very cool. And also, I wanted to get your opinion on a couple things uh, relating to my channel in the future, so we'll get to that at the end. So first off, just to start, um, for those of you who don't know, uh, I will be heading to Paris on Sunday. Uh, you may have seen me mention this on Twitter or in my live streams, but super excited to go. Um, it's going to form the basis for probably about two more v Assassin's Creed pilgrimage videos. So, you know, one for Paris and maybe another one for Versailles, Saint-Denis. But I'm super excited. We'll check out all the landmarks of Unity, and I'm just really excited for it, and I hope you guys are too. I know a lot of you love the, the Italy and Istanbul episodes of Assassin's Creed pilgrimage, so I'm excited to bring you guys more, uh, more of those videos. Now, to supplement this trip to Paris and also future interviews you know after I interviewed um, even Patrice at uh, E3 this last year I was really disappointed with the video quality in both of those I'd been trying out a new camera but it wasn't very good and so I finally decided to just like I'm just gonna splurge and get this awesome new camera that I want to show you guys um, I'm actually using it to film right now so consider this like a little brief preview but also splice in some footage of what it looks like it's like a Panasonic HC V770. It's one of the top of the line cameras, like video camcorders out there. And importantly, it does really well in low light as well. And so that would really help with the type of in E3 interviews I usually do. But I'm also really excited just to take it like to the Parisian catacombs and, you know, areas like that. I think it'll look really spectacular. So expect greatly increased video quality on future pilgrimage episodes with Paris coming up soon, obviously, and also interviews in the future. So I'm really excited. Um, I'm sorry it's taken this long for me to really up the video quality of these things, but I really appreciate it. These are, these are your ad dollars at work. So thank you to everyone who's supported my channel, you know, since the beginning and, and everything. Um, to go along with it, I also want to show off this. Um, it's a shotgun microphone. Um, it's a Shure shotgun microphone. And basically this can mount to the top of my camera and pl my new uh, video camcorder and um, hook into it. And this will be useful for things like um, panels and stuff. So if you think about uh, things like the SAC anime panels that I recorded last year with the Assassin's Creed voice actors, like this would get much better audio quality and the video quality would obviously be improved as well. Um, so not only that, but if I ever go back to San Diego Comic-Con and they do more Assassin's Creed panels, I think it'll be great for those too. So I just thought I'd show you guys I'm really investing in um, making higher quality audio visual um, content for you guys. Um, I'm really excited. So Assassin's Creed pilgrimage videos, um, expect them to be out sometime in October. Um, other than that, I have a podcast coming out tomorrow with Richard Faris, the lead writer of Assassin's Creed Rogue. Long overdue. Um, <laughs> just, I got caught up in a lot of work stuff, um, and also I was working on that video with Roger Craig Smith about AC Chronicles China, hopefully all you guys have seen um, and enjoyed, because I loved working on that video with Roger, um, and I'm pretty proud of how it turned out. Um, but yeah, so I'm trying to get back into the podcast thing. I also wanted to interview Travis Stout, who is lead writer of Unity, and I'll try to get that out before Syndicate comes out. And then once Syndicate comes out, um, you know, I've talked to both Paul and, well, I've talked to Paul, and he's definitely on board f um, for a podcast. He is the, of course, the uh, actor who portrays Jacob. And I haven't talked to Victoria, who plays Evie directly, but um, from what I understand, she's pretty much on board. And so I would just like to, one of the things I wanted to ask you guys is how would you like to see the format of any interviews with Paul and uh, Victoria? Because it seems like we definitely would want to have them on a podcast together, but also I don't want to shortchange either of them. So would you want to see just like one really long episode and like first third is Paul, second third is Victoria, and then last third is both of them? Would you want to see three separate podcasts split up like that? Or would you want to see just one podcast with both of them, no separate interviews? Like, I'm still trying to figure it out on my own, so I'd love to hear what you guys have to think about this. Um, and then, obviously, I'll be doing a lot more podcasts for Syndicate once the game comes out. Once Syndicate does come out, um, you may have noticed that I've been live streaming a lot lately. Um, the highlights, obviously, being uh, my Saturday Assassin's Creed streams. A lot of people seem to really love those. And I will be streaming Syndicate once it comes out. I'll just be doing kind of like a marathon of the first few days um, of playing it. So I hope you guys will join me for that. Um, the other thing I wanted to get your guys' opinion on is of the live streams I've been doing lately, which I've been doing a lot, uh, you know, you've probably noticed. <laughs> and I know it's probably a, ch a big shift in how you've seen content from me being released on my channel. I kind of like it just because I love the interaction with the, with the chat. Um, we got ourselves a nice little group going on. Um, 
it also lets me explore other games like with you guys and we a lot of times half the time we're talking about Assassin's Creed anyway or we're relating things to Assassin's Creed but I would love to know um, if you guys think it's too many non Assassin's Creed live streams if you mind seeing the archives in my channel or what you think in general of it um, because I know it's a big change the other thing I like is that it gives me regular I, I'm really bad at sticking to a schedule for my content, but these live streams are an easier way for me to kind of give you guys some consistent content if you want it. But I would love to know um, what you guys have thought of the live stream so far. If you think it's too many, or um, if you want me to keep going uh, with all the non Assassin's Creed live streams, or if you just don't want to see the archives cluttering up my thing. One thing I've thought about is maybe just leaving the most recent archive uh, episode public. So, like, part seven of Shadow of Mordor, but then parts one through six would be unlisted and in a playlist. So you can still get to them, but you don't see all seven in my channel if you're trying to just browse for the Assassin's Creed content, because this is still very much an Assassin's Creed focused channel. Nothing about that has changed. It's more just I'm letting you guys in on my other game playing as well. So please let me know what you guys think about in the comments. Um, and uh, maybe one last thing before I go, a plug for, uh, you know, so I have the podcast coming out tomorrow with Richard, but on Saturday, uh, September 19th, I believe, is Talk Like a Pirate Day. And I am very excited to do, it lines up perfectly with my weekly Assassin's Creed streams. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be playing Assassin's Creed 4, um, and we'll be turning on the R matey cheat, which makes Edward only talk like in pirate cliches, you know, like six men dead on a dead man's chest or whatever. You know what I mean? <laughs> so I think it'll be an awesome live stream. Uh, I hope you guys stop by for it. Uh, and then the day after that, I'll be leaving for Paris. So no live streams until I get back um, on the 28th, I believe, which is a Monday after the Saturday Assassin's Creed 4 one. Anyway, just thought I'd give you guys an update on what I'm up to, what I'm planning. Um, got lots of exciting Assassin's Creed stuff in store. So please let me know, what you again, what you think about uh, podcast interviews for both Paul and Victoria, like what kind of format you would like to see, assuming I can get um, both of them to agree to it, which I don't think there should be any problems. And then also what you think of the current live streaming uh, shenanigans slash going ons. And yeah, so I'll see you guys tomorrow for the podcast. And I hope to see a lot of you on Saturday for Talk Like a Pirate Day. See you later.